Hi, my name is Sarah from um, Switzerland. Thank you very much, Skype and Victoria, for this opportunity. Now, my question to Victoria is, how are you able to um, reinvent yourself with each collection and still maintain your brand identity? For me, it's not about reinventing. It's about um, it's about evolving and staying true to myself and my brand and retaining that signature, but then having a fashion message. Um, which will change season on season, but it's never about reinventing. Many people say that fashion f uh, trend forecasting is not effective uh, anymore within this industry because you get uh, internet and uh, many other um, c communication technologies, so you can have like all kinds of information you want within one second. Uh, do you agree with this statement? I, I do agree in a way that, that fashion for that f trend forecasting is um, works only to a certain extent really it's because the, the the great thing about the fashion business is that it is a creative business so it's not something that you can over analyze and and um, have all the answers for in a scientific manner uh, fashion forecasting is something useful in that it's done by people who are actually studying the zeitgeist and trying to understand what what trends are so i think it's something that can inform your work but ultimately you again there's always the question mark whether you've got it right or not hello my name is laura armstrong and i'm an event producer working in london Hi Victoria, as an event producer, I would love to know what happens behind the scenes. So I would like to know what happens as soon as the show finishes backstage. Thank you. Straight after the show, I will be backstage. Um, some people have to rush out straight after the show because they have to get to another show. Um, but a lot of press will come backstage. They'll ask me about the, uh, about the collection and I talk about it. Um, some of them will be snapping away, taking pictures, some will be, be filming, some will be um, making notes. And I talk about the collection. Um, and whilst I'm doing that, um, the production team have already started dismantling, um, you know, the, the, the set in some way. Because we have to load out almost as soon as the show has actually finished. So our turnaround time is always quite tight. Um, but that's just the way that it goes. Hi, I'm Charlene Campbell, and I'd love to know what your top tips are for surviving at New York Fashion Week. Hi, Charlene. I've got uh, one very recent top tip about 10 minutes ago. Make friends with your cab driver, especially if it's snowy in New York. Um, just pointing at my shoes here, I've just had to go around the block and if you don't charm them, they will not take you.